Hello friends, welcome to our channel CBSC English, the topper's choice. In this video, we are going to discuss multiple choice questions of class 8th, 9th lesson from the book Honeydew, The Great Stone Face, part 1. Here we go. Question number 1. At what time did Ernest and his mother sat outside their cottage? Options are Sunset, Sunrise, Midnight or Dawn? And the right answer is Sunset. Question number 2. They had only to lift their eyes and there it was, plain to be seen. It refers to Dash. Options are the Native Valley, the Great Stone Face, the Great River or none of the above. And the right answer is the Great Stone Face. Question number 3. What brightened all its features? Options are Torchlight, Moonlight, Sunlight or Snow. And the right answer is sunlight. Question number four. What was the great stone face? Options are a pile of rocks that resembled a human face, a work of nature, both A and B or none of the above. And the right option is both A and B. That is a pile of rocks that resembled a human face and a work of nature. Question number five. The great stone face was only visible from a particular distance. True or false? Options are true, false, partially true or partially false. And the right answer is true. Question number 6. One would lose the outline if they went to dash. Options are far, near, low or high. And the right answer is near. Question number 7. But seen from a distance, the clouds clustering about it, the great stone face seemed positively to be dash. Options are alive, dead, sleeping or awake and the right answer is alive. Question number 8. Who did people believe they owed the fertility of the valley to? Options are earnest, rainfall, the great stone face or the prophecy. And the right answer is the great stone face. Question number 9. What do you mean by prophecy? Options are statement that tells what happened in the past, statement that tells what will happen in the future, statement that tells what is happening right now or any statement. And the right answer is statement that tells what will happen in the future. Question number 10. What did the old prophecy say? Options are a man bearing the likeness of the great stone face will come. The man will be greatest and noblest of his time. The man will be born in the valley or all of the above. And the right option is all of the above. Question number 11. Did Ernest want to live enough to see the prophecy come true? Options are yes, no, maybe or not mentioned in the story. And the right answer is yes. Question number 12. Dash was an affectionate and thoughtful woman. Options are Ernest's neighbor, Ernest's grandmother, Ernest's 
great grandmother or Ernest's mother? And the right answer is Ernest's mother. Question number 13. Did Ernest ever forget the story his mother told him? Options are yes, no, maybe or not mentioned in the story. And the right answer is no. Question number 14. Ernest was a happy and pensive child. What do you mean by the word pensive? Options are thoughtful, helpful, beautiful or grateful. And the right answer is thoughtful. Question number 15. What did Ernest do after finishing the work of the day? Options are go home, gaze at the great stone face, play or see his friends. And the right answer is gaze at the great stone face. Question number 16. What was the name of the first man they suspect to be the man from the prophecy? Options are gather gold, blood and thunder, earnest or none of the above. And the right answer is gather gold. Question number 17. What did he do for a living? Options are he was a farmer, he was a shopkeeper, he was a soldier or he was a commander. And the right answer is he was a shopkeeper. Question number 18. Why did he want to come to the valley? Options are for vacation, to do business, to spend his weekend where he was born or to spend his last few days where he was born. And the right answer is to spend his last few days where he was born. Question number 19. What was Ernest doing when the man arrived? Options are working, gazing at the valley, waiting to welcome him, not mentioned in the story. And the right answer is gazing at the valley. Question number 20. Did the man resemble the great stone face according to Ernest? Options are yes, no, maybe or not mentioned in the story. And the right option is no. Question number 21. What did the stone face seem to tell Ernest? Options are fear not. The man will come, nothing or both A and B and the right option is both A and B that is fear not the man will come. Question number 22. Who saw nothing remarkable in Ernest's way of living? Options are the great stone face, Ernest, gather gold or Inhabitants of the valley and the right answer is inhabitants of the valley. Question number 23. What was folly but pardonable? Options are earnest gazing at the valley, earnest living an unremarkable life, earnest being neighborly or earnest being diligent and hardworking. And the right answer is Ernest gazing at the valley. Question number 24. Ernest was dash. Options are industrious, kind, neighborly or all of the above. And the right answer is all of the above. Question number 25. Who did the great stone face become for Ernest? Options are friend, teacher, enemy or mentor and right answer is teacher. Question number 26. The wisdom 
that came to him was better than the one that can be learned from dash options are teacher friend enemy or book and the right answer is book question number 27 did ernest know that the thoughts that came to him were of higher tone than what all men shared with him options are yes no maybe or not mentioned in the story and the right answer is no question number 28 who was the second man they judged to be the man from the prophecy options are gather gold blood and thunder earnest or none of the above and the right answer is blood and thunder question number 29 who was blood and thunder options are commander shopkeeper farmer or teacher and the right answer is commander question number 30 did blood and thunder bear resemblance to the great stone face options are yes no maybe or not mentioned in the story and the right answer is no so dear friends if you have liked this video please click on like subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon to get more videos like this thank you very much for watching